The Republican candidate for Ohio's U.S. Senate seat that's up for grabs this fall, making a stop in our region today. Bernie Marino paid a visit to Finley, stopping at Dietz's Ice Cream for a cool treat and conversation with potential voters. Marino is a longtime businessman who purchased his first car dealership in 2005 and grew that investment into a large group of car dealerships. Endorsed in the race by former President Donald Trump, Marino says Ohioans need a senator who will work for them and to keep and restore manufacturing jobs, lower prices. Marino talked about sharing Brown and his supporters focusing attacks on him and his track record at his car dealerships. After 50 years in elected office, Sher Brown's never had a job in a private sector and knocks me for having a job. The reality is he can't defend his record. He's got a hideous voting record for Ohio. He votes even far left more so than Elizabeth Warren or Bernie Sanders, the most radical leftist in the United States Senate. So rather than defend his record, talk about why he should get six more years after 50 in elected office, his best line of attack is attacking me. It's pretty pathetic. Joining Marino on his swing through Finley was longtime Republican senator from the state of Wyoming, John Barrasso. He says Marino knows what needs to be done in Washington to help Ohioans and the rest of the country. With folks on the street, visiting with business leaders, visiting with people around the state of Ohio, everything we can do to get Bernie to the United States Senate. He's going to be a voice of reason. He knows we can't live with the open borders and all these people that are coming in illegally, 10 million of them. He knows Ohio families can't live when prices are 20% higher than they were when Joe Biden came into office. Marina will face longtime incumbent Democrat Sherrod Brown in the November general election.